Do you want higher FPS, lower ping, and smoother gameplay, especially on a low-end PC? I just found something called Plexity, and it could completely change how Roblox runs on your system. Today, we're testing it side-by-side -side with full PC optimizations to see if it's the real deal. So without wasting any time, let's jump straight into the video. Gear Up Booster is one of the best program for optimization of your ping while you're playing Roblox. Using a wired or wireless connection, get this paid program for free from my description and enjoy your game with lower ping. Step 1. Optimize Roblox for best performance on low-end PCs. Let's start by making your PC faster so Roblox can run better. We're going to turn off some fancy Windows effects that slow things down. Click on the Windows search bar and type Adjust the appearance and performance of Windows. Click the option that pops up. A window will open called Performance Options. Now in that window, select the option that says Adjust for Best Performance. This will turn off all the extra visual stuff that just slows down your system, which helps Roblox run faster. But if you still want things to look a little nicer, you can keep two things turned on. Smooth edges of screen fonts. This will keep the text from looking jagged so it's easier to read. Show thumbnails instead of icons. This helps you see little previews of your files instead of just plain icons. After setting that up, click Apply to save the changes. Next, go to the Advanced tab in that same window. Under Processor Scheduling, choose Adjust for Best Performance of Programs. This will give more power to Roblox instead of background stuff running behind the scenes. Click OK to save and close everything. That's it. These small changes will make your system smoother, reduce lag, and increase your FPS in Roblox. Step 2. Use Plexity to boost FPS and make Roblox smoother. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. Now let's use a tool called Plexity, which is a special Roblox launcher that helps boost FPS, reduce lag, and fix stuttering, especially if your PC isn't super powerful. Start by downloading Plexity from the FPS Boost Pack. After it's downloaded, run the installer and follow the setup steps. Once it's installed, click the Windows search bar, type Plexity, and open it. When it opens, you'll see a welcome screen that says, Welcome to Plexity. Let's go over the settings inside Plexity, and I'll explain exactly what each one does. Clean Roblox temp files. Turn this on. It will clean up temporary Roblox files that can slow down your menus or in-game UI. This helps things feel snappier. Clean Roblox. Logs. Turn this on too. Roblox saves log files every time you play, and they pile up. This clears them out and reduces lag. Multi-threaded rendering. Enable this. It allows your CPU to use all of its cores when Roblox runs, giving you smoother gameplay, especially on newer processors. Allow cross-game teleportation limit. Turn this on. It speeds up loading between games in Roblox that use teleporting. Bottleneck detection, optional. Only enable this if you think your CPU or GPU is being overused. It balances power between them. I'm not using it here to test Plexity on its own. Roblox cursor. Customization. You can customize your cursor using packs from the Plexity Discord server. I'll leave a link for that. Download cool cursors and apply them right inside Plexity. Fast flag section, the real power. Now we're getting into advanced performance tweaks. Refresh rate unlock. Turn this on to allow Roblox to run at your monitor's full refresh rate. If you have a 144 Hz monitor, Roblox can now run at 1044 FPS instead of being capped. To check your refresh rate, go to Settings, System, Display, Advanced Display, and look for your screen's refresh rate. Set Roblox to match the highest one you see. Use Max Frame Rate. This removes the FPS cap so your graphics card can go all out. More FPS equals smoother gameplay. Texture Quality. You can choose Low, Medium, or High. If you're using mods like Block Shade, use High. But if your PC is weak, set it to Low for better performance. Render Mode. Set this to DirectX, DX. Don't use Metal unless you're on a Mac. It won't work well on Windows. Avoid Task Scheduling Conflicts. This prevents your PC from doing background tasks while you're playing Roblox. It reduces lag and keeps your game smooth. Plugins. Tab. Here are a few helpful tools inside the Plugins section. Server Info. Shows ping and server location. Uninstall Roblox. Cleanly removes Roblox if needed. Temporary Files. Cleaner. Deletes unused files and cache for better speed. Tweaks. Tab extra tools to improve performance. 
Install API for Blockshade. Required if you're using Blockshade mod. DirectX Renderer. Gives better FPS and compatibility on Windows. Installing fast flags for more performance. Now let's install special graphics tweaks. Go to the Editor Settings tab in Plexity. Scroll to the bottom and click Add New. Open the Boost Pack folder and look for the text file inside. This file has several fast flag presets. Here's what each preset does. Plexity. Fast flag graphics for FPS. Best for boosting FPS. Plexity. Ping fast flag graphics. Best for lowering ping. I'm using the FPS version. Open the file, copy all the text, and paste it into Plexity's fast flags editor. Click OK and hit Yes if anything pops up. Now save the settings, close Plexity, and open Roblox. You'll notice a huge difference in how smooth the game runs. In this step, I'm going to show you the best tool to get stable ping for Roblox. So first download the Gear Up Booster tool from the official website using the link in the description. After downloading, install it on your PC. Once installed, you'll see the Gear Up Booster interface. The first thing you'll need to do is log in with your Facebook or Google account. On the Home tab, you'll find all the games installed on your PC. If you go to the Games tab, you can browse thousands of games available for optimization. To optimize your network and FPS, return to the Home tab and select the game you want to boost. For example, I'll select Roblox. Click the Boost button and the tool will begin optimizing the game. It will automatically find the best server for you. Next, you'll need to choose your server region. Select the nearest server for the best connection. In my case, the Middle East server works best. After selecting the server, close the window. Now go to the End tab where you'll see a list of servers available in the Middle East. Choose the nearest one or let GearUp automatically pick the best server for you. I recommend setting it to automatic for the best results. Finally, close the window and launch your game using GearUp Booster. This will help you optimize Roblox or any other game for lower ping and higher FPS. Step 3. Boost CPU performance by unlocking all processors. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. Let's now boost your CPU power using a tool called Park Control. Download and install Park Control. Open the app and choose the power plan called Bitsum Highest Performance. This lets your CPU run at full speed without being slowed down. Now adjust these settings. Parking AC, set to 100% and disable it. Parking DC, set to 100% and disable it. Frequency Scaling AC, set to 100 and disable it. Frequency Scaling DC, set to 100 and disable it. Next, turn on Bitsum Dynamic Boost. This lets your CPU save energy when you're not gaming but go full power during Roblox gameplay. Then go to your Windows Power Options and set Bitsum Highest Performance as the active plan. Click, make active, then hit Apply to lock in the changes. This helps your CPU deliver its full power when you need it most. Step 4. Optimize GPU performance with MSI Utility. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. Now we'll boost your GPU graphics card using a tool called MSI Utility. Open MSI Utility as administrator. Find your GPU in the list. Enable MSI mode by checking the box. Then set interrupt priority to high. Save and close the utility. This will make your GPU respond faster and give you more FPS in Roblox. Step 5. Disable startup apps for a faster PC. Final step. Let's stop background apps from slowing your PC at startup. Open Task Manager and go to the Startup tab. Disable all apps you don't need running when your PC turns on. This gives more power to Roblox and other games, and your system will boot faster too. Final words. Plexity is honestly one of the best tools out right now for Roblox optimization. It's safe, effective, and super customizable. You'll notice smoother gameplay, higher FPS, and lower ping right away. If this helped you, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and share this with a friend who also plays Roblox. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.